windows and ledges as fire engulfed the 16-storey building in the heart of Kowloon's shopping district. One fireman was killed as he battled the blaze. Caroline Kerr reports. The fire broke out in a skyscraper on Hong Kong's Nathan Road, in the heart of the territory's shopping district. It started on the ground floor, but spread quickly to the upper storeys through a lift shaft. Within minutes, it had engulfed the whole of the top of the building. Inside, terrified office workers waved handkerchiefs through windows to signal for help. In all, 160 firefighters rushed to the scene to rescue the injured, most of whom were suffering from smoke inhalation and needed immediate hospital treatment. As night fell, the rescue operation continued and those inside became more desperate. Some were pulled from window ledges to safety, others were winched precariously onto helicopters. Late into the evening, rescue workers were still fighting to control the blaze. Caroline Kerr, ITN. On News at 10 with... ...onto window ledges, holding on precariously as they desperately called for help. Some were rescued by helicopters, which braved intense heat and smoke to pluck people from the roof. A steady flow of ambulances ferried victims to nearby hospitals. So far, almost 100 people have received medical treatment, and one firefighter died when he fell down an elevator shaft. It was through such a shaft, officials say, that the blaze spread from the building's lower floors where it started to the top. As a huge cloud of smoke enveloped the area, the fire burned out of control for nearly six hours. There are fears that more people may be trapped in the charred structure and that the number of dead could rise. Mike Chinoy, CNN, Hong Kong.